for abandonment of uh, 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 you know an open tender system. So, can he confirm that he is not just speaking idly? That there is a a document, a document by government justifying the departure from in terms of policy, and also honourable chair, let us remember the provisions of Article 10 of the Constitution. Article 10 inserts the participation of the people at the point of policy formulation and a change of policy. So that Honorable CS, if indeed government was abandoning this path, having found this justification, you needed to involve people and tell people that going forward, if we are discussing expansion of JKIA or any other uh, national infrastructure projects, we are going to go the PPP way. So that policy change, uh, Chair, we have to locate it in time and the process. Was it a cabinet uh, decision? Who made that decision? And how uh, were the, the people involved in the, the decision making? Chair. Yes, Madam, yes. yes. I thought we had agreed that all members ask questions then supplementary at the Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. But uh, I just allow, because that, that one was so close point, to what we were saying. A point of order about Section 4 that the Minister referred to, it refers to a 